10 Hadith on Environment. If a Muslim plants a tree or sows seeds, and then a bird, or a person or an animal eats from it, it is regarded as a charitable gift for him. Bukhari. Abdullah ibn Amr ibn al az may Allah be pleased with him, reported that the Prophet passed one day by Sa'd ibn Abi Waqqas, may Allah be pleased with him, while he was performing wudu, ritual cleaning of body parts in preparation for prayer. The Prophet asked Sa'd why is this wastage Sa'd replied is there wastage in wudu also the Prophet said yes even if you were at a flowing river Ahmad and authenticated Ahmad Shakir. Mu'ad, may Allah be pleased with him, reported that the Prophet warned, beware of the three acts that cause you to be cursed, relieving yourselves in shaded places that people utilize in a walkway or in a watering place. Hassan, by al-Albani. Abu Zar al Ghafari, may Allah be pleased with him, reported that the Prophet, peace and blessings be upon him, said, removing harmful things from the road is an act of charity. Al Albani. The Prophet said, whoever kills a sparrow or anything bigger than that without a just cause, Allah will hold him accountable on the day of judgment. The companions said, O oh Allah's Messenger, is there a reward for us in serving the animals? He replied, there is a reward for serving any living being. Bukhari. Abdullah ibn Umar, may Allah be pleased with him, narrated that the Prophet said, a woman entered the hell fire because of a cat which she had tied, neither giving it food nor setting it free to eat from the vermin of the earth. Bukhari. Prophet, please be upon him. Said, the world is sweet and green, and verily Allah is going to install you as vicegerents in it in order to see how you act, Sahih Muslim. Anas ibn Malik reported, the Prophet, peace be upon him, would perform ablution with one mud half a kilogram of water, and would perform a ritual bath with one saw two kilograms of water, up to five mud two and a half kilograms of water. Prophet, peace be upon him, said, while a man was walking along a path, he found a thorny branch of a tree on the way and removed it. Allah thanked him for that deed and forgave him, Sahih al-Bukhari. Protect environment to save humanity and earth.